10, a home filled with rats, but a new ordinance could soon help this family and many others like them. But while the idea is designed to keep those renters, it could also cost them. 41 Action News reporter Ariel Rothfield live in Kansas City with exactly how it works. Ariel? Mike, a lot of people here in Kansas City rent properties, but right now there is no city ordinance requiring those properties to be inspected by the city. That could soon change. Downstairs, you can quickly see them scurry. Outside, yeah, they're about a little smaller than a squirrel. It's become an all too familiar sight. It's bad, you catch about three a day. Far from the home sweet home, John Church and his family thought they were renting. It's hard to sleep at night, really, with them. You know, wow. gotta keep a light on because. It's just really disgusting when one crawls up on your leg. Now Kansas City is working to protect renters from such hazards. City leaders are looking into requiring interior inspections for all rental properties. There is a small minority of, of landlords that uh, have been abusing the system, have had people living, frankly, in squalor and in conditions that people in the 21st century shouldn't be living in. Like Overland Park and Independence, if passed, Kansas City would charge landlords an annual fee and require properties to pass health and safety inspections. But some worry inspection fees will trickle down to those like Church. This is a little one. Who are already looking for inexpensive rent. In fact, this year in Jefferson City, state lawmakers tried to pass a bill banning cities from conducting inspections without a tenant's consent. It failed. We don't want to make people homeless. And so that's what we're balancing right now. Whatever ordinance the city decides upon will have to go before voters for final approval. Live in Kansas City, Ariel Rothfield, 41 Action News. Wow, Ariel, thank you. As you mentioned, Independence and Overland Park have already passed similar rental inspection ordinances. Independence will start enforcing theirs tomorrow. Overland Park will begin the 1st of July.